so I read on the internet that in Jordan, in Amman, it's still not very cool to wear shirts as a man. Since I didn't really have pants to bring with me, I decided just to wear shirts and uh, let's see what happens. <laughs> Good morning guys, good morning from Amman, Jordan, my new country and I'm so excited to show it to you. Just look where we are, like this is, this is crazy, like this is some ancient ruins, like some houses where people still live and right there is my hostel where I'm staying. I just arrived yesterday at night, really late and today I woke up not so early as I planned because it's very hot actually during the day so I think it makes sense to uh, go on some adventures in the morning but now it's it's what it's 11 a.m. and uh, yeah I just left the hostel for the first time it's insane like everything's so different you know like the houses the smells uh, I really have like this sensory overload because it's so different from from Germany where I spent my last few months and the plan for today is the following food first things first I need to get my breakfast I want to try some local cuisine and uh, also I need to buy pants we'll see if I can find them uh, yeah these two things are planned for this vlog and on the way we're gonna talk to some people I'm gonna show you uh, the city the city of Amman look at the palm trees and yeah, everything's different, you know, like the houses and cars. It's totally new world for me. And I'm so excited, really. I haven't been traveled for a while now and I just decided to go to Middle East. Why not, right? Look at this. Isn't it crazy? It's like a new other world that I haven't explored yet and I'm right in the beginning. When I was sleeping in the hostel, I also realized that there are you know, like this, this uh, street noises are completely different. Like the ambience of the streets, it's so insane, it's loud, it's hectic. You can hear it actually, like the buses and like everyone, horns and stuff. Okay, so let's get some food. Salam alaikum. Good morning. <laughs> City center there? Yes. Okay, okay, shukran. Wow, the locals are very friendly. Who knew? Apparently the city is built this way, so it's kind of like there are lots of hills and uh, the lower you go, the closer you are to the city center. Oh, look at this cat. Yeah, notice there are lots of cats in Amman, lots of cats. But unfortunately, I have allergy uh, against cats, so it doesn't really matter. Wow. Lots of different shops, lots of vendors, lots of food. Okay, so I think I need to figure out where do I go next because... Because I'm pretty lost, to be honest. Oh, yeah, it was a wrong turn for sure. Okay, I think this way. Wow. And it smells different, you know? Like, the smells are totally insane, it's like another world. Okay, so I think I'm going to the right direction. Wow. And look at this, at these steps, like steps are everywhere, you know? I'm just like descending more and more towards, I guess, city center. I hope so. And I kind of like it. I like it already, yeah. Wow, how loud and hectic it is. And also, I don't understand anything written because it's in Arabic. I have no idea, like no signs I can understand. Okay, so this one looks like like a main street or something, yeah. Okay, I think I need to figure out where to go next. Now I know what the problem is. Google Maps doesn't really work well in this part of the city. So yeah, I think I need to download some local maps, I guess. Um, okay, so it seems that I need to go there. Look at the palm trees, wow. I, like, every time I go to a country a little bit southern than like Germany, these palm trees, I'm just in love because, you know, it feels like eternal summer for me. Like, the climate is everything. I, I really love it. 
Here you can buy some suits. Oh, it's some local restaurant, I think. Maybe I should eat there and not go to the recommended place by my uh, hostel owner because, you know, it should be pretty touristic. Let's see, let's see what people eat here. Oh, so some sweet stuff, like baklava and stuff. Okay, I think, I think it's a sweet, sweet food. Maybe we'll, we'll check that later. But now I think I want to eat something like more savory, you know, like maybe some falafel or uh, what people eat here for the breakfast, I don't know. I think falafel and hummus, let's see. Wow, spices. And that's why it smells so good, because everywhere you can feel this, this uh, aromat like in the air constantly. Like here, for example, right? Wow, wow, wow. I'm literally overwhelmed by, just like by excitement, because this is crazy. Just look, look at the street. Okay, I've been waiting like for this red light to turn green for like five minutes. It doesn't happen, so I think, uh, yeah, just locals just, just walk and it doesn't really matter what, what light is. I don't know. Let's see, let's just follow this man. Okay. Okay, it works. And you know what? The air here is very dry. Because... What is that? There are flights, like, oh my god, everything. Yes, I was saying the air here is very dry, because obviously, surprise, surprise, we're in the desert. So, it feels, it feels different for sure. It's a different type of, of hut here. Okay, so, I think this is the place that uh, my hostel owner recommended to me. And uh, let's see what we can find here. I think... I think falafel and hummus will be nice now. I'm so hungry. Like, it's 11 and the last time I ate was like yesterday, maybe at 5 or something. So, wow. It's very chaotic. I love it. Okay, so what's going on here? How do I order food? Should I sit somewhere? Should I just go and order? I don't know. Wow. It's a lot of food. It's a lot of fucking food. Okay, let's let's take a look. Let's take a look first. There's some vegetables, some chickpeas over there. Can I feel a little bit? Okay. <laughs> oh, this is hummus. Yeah, so good. Spices. Wow. Yeah, olive oil. Shit. Let's find a place. And I suppose there are lots of locals here, so this place might be good if they're locals. That's that's like a rule of thumb that I try to follow. Okay, so it seems that the place is full, so uh, I'm just waiting for for some open space, I guess. I hope I understand it right, but let's see. <laughs> Wow, people are so friendly. From where are you? Uh, from Ukraine. 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 Yes. Yeah. I was thinking you are from. Uh, you are Irish or UK. And you? Where are from? Here, from Jordan. From Jordan. Aman? No. no. From a distant. Yeah, okay. yeah, very famous place it seems. Just famous. There is, uh, there is nothing special. Aha, uh -huh, nothing special. Famous. Just famous. Oh, okay. No, normal food. It's normal. We're waiting some time here. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. No problem. No hurry. You are in hurry, not, uh, not, <laughs> not here. <laughs> not here. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm, I'm not. I'm not. What are you going to eat? Uh, hummus, falafel? Food. Hummus, falafel. Potato sandwich. Sandwich? Oh. This is our particular food in breakfast. Where you are sleeping? In a hotel? Or? Uh, yes, yes, it's like a little hotel, yes. Yeah. Hostel, hostel. Yeah, yeah. It's cheap than hotel. Cheap. Cheap, cheap, cheap. Yeah. It should be like that for young people. Yes, yes. It's uh, just uh, ten, ten dollars a night? It's enough. It's enough. It's good, yeah. Just for take a rest, a little bit sleep. Yes, and then go to, to the streets, <laughs> explore. Many, many times I, I pass from here, I have no, no time to, to 
how food will be here. Meat, hummus and uh, falafel and uh, salad. What do you want to drink? Uh, drink uh, chai. So what did you do in Tajikistan? Yeah, I was uh, working with the United Nations ah. as a military reserve. Okay. Dushanbe. 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 Yes, yes. Dharmat and Samarkand. Samarkand, uh -huh. Samarkand uh, Uzbekistan. Uzbekistan. Uzbekistan, yes, huh? yes. When was it? 20 years ago. 20 years ago, okay. Yeah, more than 20 years. Uh -huh. I worked there one year. One year? Uh, I completed my military service in 1994. Yeah. Then I went outside. Yes. Harp Gold. Okay, okay. Dubai. Wow, look at that. Okay, shukran. Wow. So this is falafel? Yeah, they are bringing uh, bread together. Aha, aha. Bread here, okay. Good. Wow. And this is hummus with meat. So there is some grounded, grounded beef inside or lamb. And some salad. And bread, of course. Wow, okay. So let's give it a try. First, I'm gonna try falafel. Because first falafel in Jordan. <laughs> Wow, wow, it's very good. It's not dry at all. It's like very, very soft, crispy. Not too crispy, not over fried. It's just perfect. Mm. In Berlin, I don't usually buy falafel, but here I kind of like it. One of the first falafels I really like. Usually it's like a little bit dry to me. Uh, like I don't like the texture, but but this one is really good. Wow, the hummus is totally different from what I tried in Germany. Sacher. Sacher. <laughs> oh, you speak some Russian? I speak a little bit. A little bit, wow. I can manage it. It's... It tastes so good. This one, so far, my favorite thing. Hummus is just like out of this world. It's... And I don't really exaggerate, like this is the best hummus I've ever tried. And this is the first place, food place in Amman. I really enjoyed it. And they gave me this. It's probably like a receipt, so now I have to pay it somewhere. So what do you think? How much will it cost? I have no idea. Okay. Shukran. Best hummus I tried. <laughs> shukran, shukran. And it costed three, three Jordanian dinars. So it's around, I think it's four, four fifty euros or dollars, uh, which is yeah, it's good for the city center place where lots of people are. I think it's a really good price. And we go to the market now to see what's going on there. And also, I think I need some pants. I saw people wearing shirts, like some men wearing shirts. So I think it's okay in this part of town. But if I'm going to be traveling to some outskirts of Jordan, you know, like I'm going to be hitchhiking maybe, uh, I think I need some pants, so... Wow, what's going on here? Wow. No idea what, what just happened, no idea. And look, it's like layers of layers of houses and lots of different things going on. Okay, some stairs, 
I think I've seen it in some YouTube videos, so let's avoid it as for now. Okay, I'm trying to cross the street. Not that easy, but I think it will work somehow. Okay, for example, now. Okay, so I think it's the right way to the market. Now that I'm not hungry, I can function like a proper human being because in addition to that I'm sleep deprived. The last few days in Berlin were very hectic because some of my friends visited from California and we basically partied the whole time. I think it's a good thing that, you know, here alcohol is not so common so you can just drink tea and uh, get lost in the streets of Amman. Look, and on every street there is like this like, hidden street where there are some markets, some, some food vendors and stuff. It's like the city has really like lots of layers and look, there you can go, here you can go. Like wherever you look there is some hidden street. It's pretty easy to get lost in, in this city. So I think now we're approaching the, the market. Salam alaikum. Look, another street here, some stairs. Yeah, the city has, has some distinct Middle Eastern um, like design, that's for sure. Look at that. Okay, if it smells like a market, then probably there is a market nearby. How are you? How are you? Thank you. Oh, locals are very friendly. Oh, look at the juice. Maybe, maybe after. Maybe after, because I'm so full right now. Yeah, so far I haven't figured out how to cross the streets. Apparently, apparently you just cross the streets. That's it, just like that. Okay, that's like in Southeast Asia. No different, I guess. Okay, so I think this is part of the market with lots of fruits and veggies. Not something I'm looking for right now, but yeah, let's take a look. Yeah, lots of spices. It's mostly like nuts and spices and sweets. Wow. Okay, I need clothes section. I don't need food now. Wow, it's a lot of things going on, that's for sure. Look, different teas and spices and nuts. Ooh, this is some seafood. Probably from the Red Sea, I assume. I'm literally overwhelmed by, by this variety of, of different different fruits and foods and uh, many many other things. So let's turn right here. Looking for the pants. Oh, I see some second hand behind me. But I think what I'm looking for is like a really, really lightweight, like linen pants that I've seen here on many men. So uh, I think I should be able to find them, I guess. Let's see. Here are some pants. But not exactly what I'm looking for. Let's see. So it's a good sign. I see like pants more and more. So we're gonna find my perfect pair of pants. Hello. Marhaba. Uh, you speak English a little bit? No. No? Oh, I'm looking for uh, for pants. Pantalons. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Only this, yes? Okay, okay, okay. Shukran, shukran. Okay. Let's keep going. Lots of socks. On this market there is everything apart from the pants. Pants, 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 pants. Salam alaikum. Yeah. Like pants, like this. Yeah. Salam alaikum. Yeah. Do you have uh, pants? No. 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 Do you have uh, pants? Pants, 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 pants. Salam alaikum. Do you have, do you have pants? No pants. Okay. Where I can buy them? Like a jeans, yani? Uh, sure. Like a jeans, but light. Yeah, for yes. sport, yeah? Yeah, yeah, for walking, yeah, for walking. Yeah, you will find it there. Just go there. There. Go to the left. Left. You will find a story. His name is Mahsiri. 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 You will find everything there. Okay, yeah. okay. Left, okay. Go there, and the left, you will find it there. Okay, shukran, okay. shukran. Okay, so maybe I'm gonna be more lucky in this place. Which name I already forgot. Oh, I see some pants here. Okay, let's 
let's take a look at that place and if not return to this one because I saw some nicely looking pants. Assalamu alaikum. Okay, maybe here. I don't know. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Where are you from? Uh, Ukraine. Ukraine? Yes. Good, nice. Yes, um, I'm looking for pants, but uh, light, uh, like light pants from Linen. Maybe no, I don't have? have here. Not here. No. Only, only jeans and uh, jeans yeah. and tracksuit, pajamas. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Where, where can I find like Linen pants? I don't know. I don't no. know right. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, jeans too, too hot for now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, shukran. You're welcome. Shukran. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, so as you can see, yeah, no liner pants, and I don't want to buy jeans because it's hot. I didn't buy pants yet, but I bought soap because in my hostel there is no no soap, and I kind of need it. Maybe let's turn here. I have a feeling this is my street. Oh, okay, okay. Also, I have white if you want. Uh -huh. uh, this one, this one. This one. Any other? Uh, size? Yours. Oh. Uh -huh. But the uh, long? It's the longest one. Oh, the longest one. one. Okay. What's the price? 5 GT. 5 GT. Okay, okay. Uh, How much? 2, 2 dinars. 2, okay, okay. Aha. Wake, let's go here. But short, short, short. Oh, here come. Wake, wake model, model here. Ah. This is a serwal, here model. Okay, okay. Here okay. model. You don't have to be here. No, here you can be here. Aha, aha. Here model. Okay. This is Arabic, it's a serwal. Small, aha. Serwal or bantaram. Can I try them? Mm hmm. Uh, can I uh, try them? Uh, yes. Okay. Simpson. Okay. Uh, big quiz. Big queer. Okay. Okay. Sure. Okay. Good, right? I think. I think they fit perfect. So. Nice. Shukran. Shukran. Welcome to Jordan. Thank you. Where is home? Ukraine. 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 <laughs> okay, bye bye. Shukran, shukran. Such a friendly people, that's crazy. And I bought the pants for two dinar, so it's three, three euros, three dollars. Wow, this is crazy. And those are nice pants for just three years. I know it's common to, to bargain about the price in Middle East, but here, when buying pants for two dinar, I just like, I couldn't do it, you know, it's like, what? Like, what should I say, like one? One dinar? I mean, it's just like offensive, I think, you know? Maybe I should I should learn how to do it here in the Middle East. So I think now all my missions are accomplished and uh, I gotta go back to my hostel because it's also getting pretty hot. Assalamu <laughs> alaikum. <laughs> yes, it's, it's getting very hot and, uh, and yeah, I also have plans for the evening. Okay, I'm trying to cross the street again. Okay. And it works. Barely. <laughs> I almost got hit by a car. You know, I think it's nice to get some juice now. What do you think? Is it a good time for a juice? I think so. Hi. Assalamu Salam. Wow. Oh. Hello. Hello, hello. Marhaba. What, uh, what is that? Sugar cane. Sugar cane. Wow. What? Uh, sugar cane. Is it? Sugar cane juice, can you believe it? Okay, uh, one small, okay? How much is one small? Two dinar. Two dinar, okay. Shukran, shukran. Bye bye. Let's try this, this juice. I've tried once or twice in Southeast Asia, uh, but I really didn't expect to find this juice here, so let's give it a try. Hmm. Wow. I think it's different from what I expected, for sure, wow. It's actually not that sweet. I imagine like a juice from sugar cane would be super sweet, but it's actually kind of good, wow, refreshing. All right, guys, so I think that's it for this vlog. My first impressions of this, of this, yeah, this very hectic 
and very colorful city of Amman. And uh, yeah, I'm going out to the hostel, gonna probably edit the video, upload it, and then in the evening do something else. Wow, I'm so excited about this series. So yeah, for sure leave a like, comment, and uh, see you in the next one. Peace. But there is no fucking way I'm gonna wear these pants. It's so hot. <laughs>